Hey guys, Fumbleek here today, and welcome back to Rollercoaster Tycoon 3 Sandbox Mode. Now, last time, <laughs> I left it on such an annoying position for all of you. The comments were just fantastic. Exactly what I hoped for when I left it just before we rode the roller coaster. It was perfect. Now, we, we should probably ride it before you kill me with pitchforks. Uh, so let's just zoom in here and just click on it. And uh, hang on, let's just, I'm just going to close it. I don't care if people are on it. I'm going to chuck it in test mode and jump on it. We, we have a bit of head clipping issues here, but uh, there we go. All right, let, let's just enjoy it now, shall we? Look at this. And of course, I have ridden it before. I had to, I, I, I did ride it after the video. I just cut it out of the video because I thought it'd be good. <laughs> ah, that was fantastic. I really do love the look of this. I just wish the lighting in the game actually made it look dark, but you can't. It, it doesn't, doesn't go darker than this, but it's still pretty good, so... I'm pretty- I'm, I'm- I'm really pleased with how this roller coaster turned out. I think it turned out really great in the end. Um, we're going up and down, around here, and a bit of a corkscrew noise. And then we got that booster brake with our zero G roll, and banking it back around, and then we have some loop-de-loops -loop somewhere, I believe, eventually. I think we'll go around them now. Here we go. Double loop-de-loops around the pathway. Whoop. I, I do think it's really cool how you can't see the roller coaster from the pathways. You actually have to go on the roller coaster to see it, which I think is pretty cool. So it's kind of like this hidden uh, roller coaster that you you can't see. It's, it's pretty, pretty cool. Uh, so we, this just sort of goes back into the station right here. I don't think we even need that chain lift by the looks of it. It seems to be able to make it up without it. Um, oh, hang on. Let's zoom back in and open it up again. 6.96 uh, ratings. That's awesome. That is a really good roller coaster. Pleased with that. Uh, now, we have a few things we could do next. Um, people wanted to see a pool by the Oasis. While I think that's a good idea, and I probably will do it, I thought, like, I mean, we already do, we, we do have a pool already. Like, we have one over here. How many people are in that, by the way? Not that many. Um, yeah, I don't know. We already have a pool. But, yeah, I probably do one over here. I don't know how I'd make it look, though. Uh, and then I want to do a roller coaster. We've obviously got to build this roller coaster here, because that's not, that's just got a station. Uh, we've got to build a roller coaster in that, and then we've got to build everything else. So what I'm going to do is actually just demolish this. Actually, how wide is this, first of all? Because we need to... I want to dig down the land underneath it like we did with that other pyramid, because that worked out pretty damn well. So we got one, two, three, four... Oh, God. One, <laughs> one two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's going to be seven by seven, uh, which we will... Dig out the area. Oh, there we go. It's a bit laggy when you first select it. So we're just going to delete that bit. I'm going to lower the line now so I know where the where it's going to be placed. Because I want it in the same spot. I like it there. Uh, so let's go down to 7. And that will go just there. Uh, we'll go about there. This is probably going to be a wild mouse coaster. Because it's a pretty small space. We can't fit a nice big coaster like we had over there. So we're not going to try and do that. We're just going to go for a nice a casual sort of coaster in here. Uh, we'll go ahead and put up the walls like we did before because that seemed to work pretty well. Uh, pretty much going to do a similar thing that we did before. Because, yeah, like I said before, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with how it turned out. Better than I expected for sure. So let's do these walls. We're going to do the walls the same way so they sort of face out and actually dig it underground a bit. Uh, we'll leave that and then we'll come to that in a minute. Um... Do I want to save them? Probably should save the pieces and then copy and paste. That would be a better way to do this. Do that in a second. Alright, so put those there. Cool. Alright, let's go ahead and save the scenery. Let's go... Uh, dat wall. Let's, let's go... Oh, we already have zero, zero walls. Let's go zero, zero, zero wall. I don't... Does that actually make it go first? I don't know. <laughs> Damn it, the second. Too many zeros. Anyways, um, let's move on from that, shall we? Let's just place this down, get these walls in, and then we'll go ahead and start building the coaster. I'm not going to put floor in this one, I don't think. Or if we do, I'll do it last. Because the problem we had with the floor was that it removed the supports of the coaster, and it kind of just got in the way in general. So I think we'll do that later. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and put all these in. Okay, that's good. Uh, uh, one thing I didn't take note of is where the entrance is going to be. We should probably figure that out. So let's just open this up. It's going to be like this. Uh, sitting over... If it would... It appears to have frozen. Uh, <laughs> give it a moment while it sorts itself out. 
Oh, oh my god, what happened there? Uh, things, are, things are going slightly haywire, bear with me, bear with me. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, it's frozen again. Okay, okay. It's having a bit of a moment. Okay, okay, here we go. <laughs> right, so this is gonna go... Oh, every time I try to like, get it in the exact spot it needs to be, it like, freezes. Come on. Okay, so it needs to be... No, I'm not there. Oh, it's frozen again. I don't think this is gonna happen. Hmm. This is a slight issue, the fact that I can't actually place the bloody thing. It needs to be there, but over. Like, diagonal, a couple spaces. Uh, maybe if I... Hang on. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's, let's cancel that. Cancel! Alright, let's cancel that. Alright, hang on, let me just go over here real quick. I'm just... I probably shouldn't have cancelled that. I want to have a look at it anyway. We'll just have a look at it and work it out from the uh, from the visuals. All right, so we got the pyramid there, and we're probably going to put the station in that side somewhere. Uh, so, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then one, two, three across from there is kind of where we want to put it. I know you couldn't really see what I was counting there, but. Um, I was just figuring out where we'd put the station. Right, so let's just do a wild mouth. Have we done a wild mouth? I think we already did, didn't we? Somewhere? Or did we? Maybe we didn't. No, I don't think so. Not in this park. Okay, that's fine then. I mean, I was going to do one anyways, but I wasn't sure if I already did one. Uh, okay, where's my wild mouse? Uh, where are you? There you are. Right, so it's going to go over here somewhere. Uh, yeah, it should be about here as Kind of the line I'll put it on. I mean, we can always change the structure later on anyways. Uh, and figure out how we want to do it. Because it's not going to fit perfectly in in this area. Um, what I could do... I don't know. Mm, I could... Because I was thinking I could do it this station underground. Because then it wouldn't change the, uh, the structure at all. So if we do this right... Let me go this way. Then we can head into the, uh... If we, we can do a drop here, actually. We might as well do a sneaky little drop. Then it'll come out down here. Like that. So you just kind of, kind of, just sort of tap your head there. Um, <laughs> just tap your head on the bricks. All right, so, yeah, so if we have that underneath there, and then we can sort of bring it up on a chain lift here. Hang on, let's chuck it on test. Adjust these as well to where we want them to be. Get as many of these as we can fit. What can we put, set them as? A dinosaur, a tiger, a mouse, or a generic? Let's just go generic, shall we? Probably for the best. All right, so we'll see that come down here in a second. Oh, I thought I'd adjust that. Oh, I guess when I change the car, is it? All right. Because I, I, whenever I do a wild mouse, I don't, I don't think they should be have multiple cars per train. That seems weird. All right, that looks pretty good to me. Uh, so if we do that... Yeah, it's good. We'll go this way then, and then we can go up our chain lift. Not vertically, I don't think. Now, I don't know how tall this pyramid is, so we've got to be careful. That should probably be alright. We, we might even just build the pyramid ourselves, to be honest, because it wouldn't take that long. Uh, I might... I don't know. Let's see if we can place it again. Let's just rotate to a different angle and see if we can place it without completely lagging on this angle. Because um, that was just really annoying. Okay, so let's rotate it this way. And it's got to go... Hang on, let me... Oh, it's actually missing the back half of it, but that's all right. <laughs> For whatever reason, it doesn't have a... Oh, no, I think it was just because it was... Yeah, it's still lagging when I try to place it here. I'm not... Sh it's something about this area. I don't know, because yeah, we place a giant pyramid without any issues, but this one just is having multiple, multiple issues for some reason. So it needs to come back one square. That's all you got to do. And now it's up there. No, it doesn't... It doesn't really go in that spot where it actually needs to go for some reason. It's really, really weird. And let's bring it over here. And now if we hold control... No, that didn't make any difference whatsoever. <laughs> I don't know. That's... Uh, I'll, I'll sort that out later. Let's... Just, I just need to know if the pyramid fits over it. That, that's my only concern. 
once I know if it fits or not, then we can just build the coaster and I'll sort out the building myself later. Uh, I'll do it like off camera or whatever. Where the hell do I find the pyramid pieces? Um, oops. That's that's my email. Probably should have quit that before I uh, recorded. Uh, okay. <laughs> Anyways, apologies. Right, let's just, just figure out this, if this fits. Let's just build it over that area there. Does it need to be down like that? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Right, bear with me here as we construct the pyramid. So we can see where it shall sit. I think that's about right. And then it has the cap on top of that, I think. That's, I think that's how it goes anyways. Is that right? Or is that, is that wrong? Not sure. Might be wrong. Let's find out together. Let's build from this side then. Just so we get an idea of where it sits and how we should build this. Um, and one more there. Okay, so now we know, oh my god, they're gonna like kill themselves in that drop there. Um, now we know like sort of the height that we've got here, so what we might actually do, maybe we will go vertically just because... Ah, that's a bit of an issue though. <laughs> when I get up to the top, it just sort of... Ah, uh, yeah. How is that even possible? Hang on, let's, let's go test. Let's, let's see. <laughs> It just like sort of smashes through that little, uh, that, that bit of pyramid, no issues. And smash through it. Would be nice if we could go up vertically, but I don't think we can. Uh, I think, I think what we had was alright, unless we... No, I can't do that. What if we did? We can do that. Can we do that? No. I'm just trying to see if, how much height we can get. We just want as much height as we can get, really. So I think what we, oh, not like that. What we had was all right. That, that's probably where we're going to get to. Uh, I mean, you're going to get a bit of head injury on that on this drop here. And to be honest, I can't really do anything. Oh, unless I do that. Um, but I don't know where the pyramid's going to be. Oh, see, I don't know what we're going to run into here. I think it might be worse if we go that way. If we go down. And then, yeah, if we just go underground here, that'll be fine, I think. Uh, it's going to have a bit of speed, though. It's going to be going really fast around the corner, which is never a good thing. While you may think it's a good thing to go as fast as you can on a roller coaster, because you seem to think it's so awesome, it will kill you. And uh, that's not necessarily a good thing. Uh, I mean, obviously, it's not going to kill you in this game, but uh, they just won't want to ride the roller coasters, basically. Um, if you could have smaller openings in the pyramid, say if you could like cut out a, like these three bricks here, it'd be good because then you could just go out and around, but if they come in such large pieces that it just would make a giant hole and not look that good. Cause it, like it would create a giant hole like that. Like if this hole was way smaller, it'd be cooler. I think if we could do that, but, um, I want to drop like that and then turn, but we can't. Um... So <laughs> just go vertically down. No, it's just... That's not what I want to do. That's not what I want to do. Um... Barrel roll, yeah. Good idea. Barrel roll and a bloody, uh... You can't even... You can't... There's no way you can bank a corner, but we can do a barrel roll. So that's... Yeah. Uh, that's, yeah. <laughs> that's just, yeah. I, I don't know. This, this roller coaster just isn't as easy to build as, um... As the other one was, because it's a smaller space, but I, th I thought doing a wild mouse would be easy, to be honest, but I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. Uh, because this whole track needs to be back one piece. It needs to be about there, then we have more room to work with, but... Unless we... You know, let's go... Let's, let's just go... Go back. If we... Instead of going that way, what if we... First of all, we'll go down a little bit, so then we can sort of get it started, get it rolling. Um, go this way, and then we're going to come around. Uh, is that right? No, no, no. One, one further. Hang on, what height will we be at before? I'm not sure. Let's go down a couple there. Then around this corner. And what if we do that? does run into something there. Is it just the walls? Because that would be fine. No, it's not. <clears throat> just too steep. Um, 
It's because it runs into those, I guess. So if we do this and then go up like this, this might work. Although apparently we run into that. But this, we just don't get as high, and then we sort of come up with the same problem here, which... If we go like this and then go up. Let's try this one. How is that? Before we were like literally smashing into it and now all of a sudden it's... T How can we can do that but not that? I don't understand. How does that make sense? We can... Okay, so we can do that. Alrighty. Oh, and then we can do that, but we can't... Wow, alrighty. But we can't, we can't do that piece there. Wow, alrighty game, alrighty. What if we do this? There you go! Although we've, we've kind of come into the same exact problem we had before, so... Um... <laughs> that is atrocious! Oh, this is not working out. Um, let's just leave this. Let's cl let's actually just delete this. We might... I think we'll come back to it because this is just... This is not working out for me now. I need, I need your, like, suggestions on what we do there. Because that was not working well. Um... Yeah, give me some ideas on that, please. Uh, right, we could go ahead and jump onto that coaster over there. Or... Um... Sat coaster, build a pool. I guess the pool would probably be here somewhere. Maybe around the back as well. Um, and I'm not sure what we'd do over there yet either. But let's just jump onto this coaster because I think that's something we can work on. Let's jump into build mode. And uh, how is our roller coaster at the moment? Um, <clears throat> let's, uh, how, how long is it? Let's make it a bit longer, or as long as it can be six. All right, that's fine. Um, let's go this way. And now we just want to go up a chain lift hill here, basically. Uh, can we guess? Oh my god, not like that. But we can go a little bit steeper there, because I just want to get over that sort of bit there. Uh, can we go up this without destroying the land? That is gonna smash into the land, I mean... This, I don't know what's going on with this chain lift hill, but we'll... We'll work with it for now, of course we can change it, don't worry, but I'm just sort of playing around as usual. Let's come up this way. Oh my god, how did I do that? <laughs> I don't even know how I managed to do that. Alright, let's keep going this way. Uh, we'll probably adjust the landscape under it as well, of course, as we usually do. And then this roller coaster will basically be built over this sort of area here. And then it will come back, obviously, kind of where we put that, that piece of track there is where it will come back in and um, and join up. So, <laughs> it's snaking up that hill. That looks really weird. It's kind of cool, though, to be honest. Not something I've done before, I can honestly say. Um, right, so it will come up here. Uh, might go one one long piece, because I, I want all the, most of the coaster up the top of the hill before we start dropping. Uh, if we go one longer. And then we sort of go down here. And then we'll, we'll adjust the land underneath it, like I said, so it won't be... Because I, I don't know. I don't know if it's just me, but I never like coasters. Like I, don't, I, like, I don't like the look of it in game, where it's just these really long supports. Um, I think it just looks better if it looks like it's been designed to fit in the terrain. Uh... I don't mind. I don't like. I don't mind this coaster here because wooden coasters look nice. But um, these kind of like steel coasters, when they go up hills, they don't look that nice. What did I do with this one? Is this just a launch, a powered launch I've done? I think so. On that one, yeah, it must be. Um, and then we did. Didn't we do it? I don't know. Yeah, it must just be a powered launch. Yeah, there it goes. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't, the chain lift hills just never look that nice. Anyways. Let's uh, bring it down now. So I'll go like that. Uh, we'll do a few few bits and bobs around here. I wonder if we can do... Can we do anything from a diagonal? Not really. Oh, that's going to smash into the land. I don't like smashing into the land. How I'm, You know how I'm not a fan of that. So we'll jump up over that. That's very nice, actually. I like how that sort of... It's hugging the terrain there. Right, so that's going to come across here, and it should straighten out more or less. All of it's up the top, and then it will start dropping. Cool. Goes really quite close to the monorail. That's pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I want to sort of duck underneath the rail at some point if we can manage to do that. It'd probably have to be over here. I don't know. I think that'll just be cool. Let's go down this way. Um, like 
this. Uh, actually, maybe we'll go this way. Hmm. That almost works. Would be cool if it did, but let's go up and we half loop. And then what can we do? We need a cork through down that way. Yeah, that's all right. Do that. <clears throat> if we could fit in another half loop there, then we could do it. That would be a cobra roll. Ooh. But we can't really fit another half loop, can we? Um, let's see. If we if we do that, I guess we're gonna alter the terrain. Be all right. Just because, <clears throat> in case you don't know, that's like that's just called a cobra roll. It's just cool. You go to half loop, cork through, and then half loop out of it. It's pretty cool. At least I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, let's go ahead and jump up there a little bit. Uh, like that. Then we'll come over this way. Maybe, no, let's not do a cork through there, because I don't think it looks that good. Oops. Uh, go down this way. Kind of a little awkward bit there, but that's all right. Uh, right, and then we, no, 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 keep going down. Let's go this way now, I think, if that's going to, oh my god, there's a volcano there. Let's see, it does its little cobra roll over there. We will adjust the terrain, like I said. That's pretty cool. I think that looks awesome. Yeah, that's good. That's good by me. Um, right, that'll come down here. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Oh, oh, don't do that. There we go. Yeah, nice cork through there. That fits in like perfectly. That just fits in just right. Uh, that's good. Uh, and then we'll go around. I think go up here. Yeah, that again. That fits just right. Wow, that is like right in the terrain. That's like perfectly fitting. Uh, anyways, I just wanted to do this so we can get up here a little bit. What if we can go down here? Don't know if this would fit too well though. Uh, damn it, that'd be cool if that could fit under there. I think it's too high up. Hmm. Here it comes. Nice corkscrew. Got, got a quite a nice, nice bit of speed there as well, actually. Uh, what if we keep going this way then? What if we go up, actually? Yeah, that's alright. We can't do any twists, can we? Nah, no, that sucks. No twists on this coaster. Alright, whatever. We'll go down here. Uh, not that way. Uh, are we able to go? No, we can't, can't manage to make it under from this height, I don't think. But if we... Ah, oh, damn it. I was hoping large helix would just make it under the track. Uh, but apparently it doesn't want to. What if we go down one more and then do it? Then it oh, may, actually, maybe it's because of that. Might be why. Nope. What if we just do a regular... F yeah, that's fine. That fits under. Awesome. Awesome to the max. All right. Can we cork through over the track? Nah, that'd have been too cool, wouldn't it? Uh, <laughs> be way too cool. That comes down there, goes under the monorail. No, it's looking pretty cool. Uh, I think this is a pretty sweet roller coaster already, to be honest. Like, I, I'm pretty happy with that. It's looking pretty sweet. Uh, right, so we're down here. If we just go like this, sort of snake it back over this way. Um, no, let's go, let's go up like that. Half loop there, maybe. We can cork through that way. I don't know. I don't know if I like the look of that though, because it just seems like it's kind of out in the middle of nowhere. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. All right, that's gonna go this way then, or not? Can we put uh, something in there? It doesn't appear we can get out of the uh, situation there. Do that. Nope, can't fit there. Uh, where is it? There it comes. Yeah, plenty of speed for that. That's cool. Let's go flat here for a little bit, and then we can come down here. I'm kind of bringing it back now. So I think I think we've done quite a bit. Ah, it fits nicely, that piece there. Uh, so we need to end up over here. So what we might do is start building this bit. 
So this will come, if we can join it to there, I think that'll be pretty good. So, let's see what we can do. That would have been cool if that sort of, <laughs> that magically lined up with that somehow. Uh, I don't think doing a corkscrew there was a good idea though, because it doesn't really fit. There's not enough room. Uh, let's see, what if we just go up and do a sort of helix that way? Uh, now, how do we manage to get it to join to that? Is the million dollar question. Unless we do this, is that, that is in line, but it's way, 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 way too high. Um, what if we do this? Hang on, I'll get rid of this part then. Mm, no, it's not ideal, is it, to have that piece there? Uh, hmm. It needs to be further that way is the problem. All right, let's go here. Let's, oh, no, 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 no. Keep it flat for a bit. Now let's go up and do it. How about this way? Let me go large helix down. Couple there, that just gets it down a little bit. Uh, and then, oh, beauty, look at that. All righty. That's all joined up. Let's see how that goes then. Let's also just give it a sneaky ride, why not? Uh, I haven't fixed up the train yet. Oh, we also hit our head on the way out in this one too. Right, that's pretty good. All right, got a bit of a snake hill lift. That's pretty interesting, I think. I think it's because it's pretty cool though, uh, in general. Uh, obviously we've got to do finishing touches, but I think it's pretty cool. Uh, it didn't take too long to build either, actually. That was, qu that was quicker than I thought. Um, Nice, got a bit of scenery there. Got a nice view up, up here actually, it's quite good. You got a nice view over prehistoric world before as well before you go down. Here we go! Yes, here we go. Dropping it down now, dropping it like it's hot. Oh freak out! Dun 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 dun. Right, anyways, um over this way, you got up, going to our cobra roll. Very cool. I think that bit's pretty cool. Except for that terrain there, that looked horrible. <laughs> we'll fix that though. Nice corkscrew. Up and around, up more. It's for speed underneath the monorail. Mono dope! Yep, Simpsons right there. Yeah, we could probably put some brakes there actually. Might be an idea. I don't know if we need to. We'll find out. We'll find out what the rating is in a minute. Um, awesome. Awesome. Well, I don't know what I was saying. That kind of got. Weirdly uh, mangled. All right, let's click on that. Uh, what are we looking at? Let's give it a bit of speed now so we can see what the rating will be. The bone rattler has been fixed. Oh, sweet. All right, come on. Where's my rating? Please rate, comment, like, and subscribe my coaster. <laughs> Jeez, hurry up. Check me the rating. All righty, thank you. Um, still not assessed. All right, still not assessed yet. It's taking its time. It's, ta it's damn taking its time, eh? Right. Well, anyways, let's just have a look at it from here. It's pretty cool. Feels like outside of the, the volcano quite nicely. Uh, still waiting to uh, assess it, actually. Hmm. I have actually clicked on the right roller coaster because I know I've done that before. I've clicked on the wrong thing. Oh, that's definitely it. <laughs> um. Okay, well while that's still assessing, let's sort of wrap things up here, I think. So, I want your feedback on, or your ideas on what we should do with this, or if you have a better solution to what I was trying to do, because the, the chain lift didn't fit in very nicely, and it was just going to be a bit of a mess in general. Uh, so if you have a better sort of idea for that, that'd be cool. Uh, I guess what, what to do, like, sort of ideas of what we can do in this big space over here. Uh, and then we'll probably do a pool in this area. There you go. That's a very good rating actually, so we, we can roll with that. Uh, we're gonna leave it on testing for now. We're not opening it yet because we'll do all the terraforming and designing. We'll do the colors and stuff next episode. And then we'll sort of open it up and get some people on there. Uh, so yeah, feedback on what to do with that little pyramid thing over there. This space over here. And there's a bit of space there too. I don't know, just kind of general ideas would be pretty good and very helpful. Uh, but yes, thank you for watching this episode of Rollercoaster Tycoon 3 Sandbox Mode. I will see you next time and have a great day. Bye.